Now we are going to see find the perimeter of the figures. The first question is right triangle. So they are given three measurements. Okay, because one side, two side, three side. So three sides are given the what measurements? Uh, this is you can consider as A and this is considered as B and C, whatever the sides may be. So that is A side is equal to four centimeter and B side is equal to five centimeter and C side is equal to what? 3 cm. So A is equal to 4 cm, B is equal to 5 cm and B is equal to, sorry C is equal to 3 cm. So this is a right triangle. This is a triangle, actually is a triangle but it is not, it is not an exact triangle. It is a right triangle because it is 90 degree. So we can call it as 90 degree means right triangle we can say. So triangle means you have three sides. So the value of A is equal to 4 cm, the value of B is equal to 5 cm, the value of C is equal to 3 cm. So now we are going to find the what right triangle to find the perimeter of. Now we are going to find the perimeter of right triangle. So the heading is find the perimeter. So you know that so you have to perimeter means you have to add all the three sides especially the right triangle. So the first one A plus B plus C that means you have to write perimeter of a triangle otherwise you can write perimeter of a triangle perimeter of a triangle add all the three sides that means A plus B plus C so A you know that what 4 centimeter and B is equal to that is 5 centimeter and C is equal to 3 centimeter so you have to add all the three values that means 4 plus 5 plus so you must what substitute the value of a is equal to 4 and substitute the value of b is equal to 5 and substitute the value of c is equal to 3 so 4 plus 5 9 9 plus 3 12 the answer is 12 centimeter this is the right answer for the question so perimeter of triangle is over so the answer is 12 centimeter next it is a what rectangle and also it's look like a, if you if you draw like this means for example if you draw like this it's like a cylindrical shape okay but it is not like a what a hemisphere is not given and a, what um, curve circle curve sphere is not given and curve circle, uh, curved space curved space or not curved space curved shape is not given so it is a rectangle uh, so it is a rectangle what are you going to do so the rectangle this is what say these two are six uh, meter and these two are this is called as length this is called as length so opposite sides are same and this is a breadth b r e a d t h breadth is equal to what one meter so you have to find it you can consider as a rectangle shape you can um, it is a rectangle shape but it is in vertical size okay vertical direction it is given but actually it is if, if you draw like this means what is this if you draw like this it is a rectangle you know that very well but but this rectangle in a what shape rectangle in a what vertical shape okay that is what so a length is equal to so both are rectangle this a diagram is a rectangle shape so six meter length and one meter breadth so area what so not area perimeter of a rectangle formula you know this perimeter of a perimeter of a rectangle perimeter of a rectangle is equal to 2 into L plus B so L what is the value of L is equal to what 6 meter and B is equal to what 1 meter B is equal to 1 meter so you have to do within the bracket L you have to substitute the value of L is equal to 6 plus breadth value is equal to 1 you have to substitute the value of B is equal to 1 so first you have to concentrate the bracket so 2 within the bracket into 7 so 6 plus 1 7 I have written so 2 into 7 the answer is 14 14 what meter so Perimeter of a rectangle is equal to what? 14 meter. This is the right answer for the question.